Hello everybody, it's me, Kofu, or Johnny Gat if you prefer. It doesn't matter, I go by both names. And no, the video file isn't corrupted. It starts out white. Hmm. I have not got any spoilers for what I'm going to react to. It's episode 14 of Aphmau's Minecraft My Street Emerald Secret. No one has given me any spoilers. I have not downloaded this file. Somebody that I'm not going to mention has helped me download this file so I wouldn't know the title and set it up on my computer screen to be full screen and I set up my recording and I don't want any spoilers to what this is and so I just hope that this episode is a happier friendlier episode. Now, before I start this reaction, I advise you if you don't know who Aphmau is, I suggest you go down to the link below and watch the Minecraft episodes. Episodes 1 through 13 as well, because if you're watching this and you haven't seen the first few episodes, I highly advise you to watch episode 1 through 13 before you watch my reaction of episode 14. But I already did that, so I don't need to. And so, here we go. Alrighty, it seems peaceful enough. We're in a kitchen? A fireplace? Aaron is asleep? Don't tell me he's in heaven. He's in please, please don't say he's in heaven. Please don't say he's in heaven. Looks like you're awake. Where am I? Who are you? Don't worry. You're safe here. Nothing here will hurt you. Who are you? Yeah. An old friend. You no always friend. manage to get yourself into trouble every once in a while. Oh, am I? Well, yes. And no. <gasps> no, no, don't tell me- That you. girl really hurt you. In more ways than one. No, no, she didn't- I'm guessing death was the easy part. Her words pierced your heart, didn't they? <laughs> I know how you feel, Aaron. No. That all happened, didn't it? I fell. She had a knife and forced me to that ledge. I should have turned her. I should have done what he said. You doubt yourself. Of course I do. I failed. I would have oh, done anything for her and I no. froze. You couldn't no. stop anyone finding out what you really are. And when the person you love the most found out... Everything she said, it was true. All my life I've been alone. I've had to be. I was a danger to everyone. Aaron, a you're monster. no danger to anybody. You will never be able to open yourself up if you're scared of what you are. Also, before I continue, sorry for the PC fan that's going on in the background, guys. I apologize, that's my fault, not yours. And so, let's continue. So far, this this guy right here, he's really creepy. I don't know how to describe this guy. He's wearing all pink on my screen, unless I'm colorblind. Or the PC screen is broken, and it's showing pink. Or purple, whatever you call this. Anyways, let's see how go this goes. And sorry for the background noise, some people are over. Aaron, you need to accept who you are. I was raised to be alone. It's a shame. You aren't the man I remember. Huh? The Aaron I remember wouldn't allow a minor setback like this one to deter him. Even when everything was lost, he pressed on. A minor setback?! The woman I love is in danger and you call it a minor setback? Exactly. Who is this She's guy? She's in danger. Being near death almost made you forget 
There are people who are in danger, Aaron. People you care deeply about. Are you just going to give up and forget them? Aaron, don't give up. I... Maybe you should. After all, the woman you loved caused this. No! She would never do this! It was never her fault! I love her! I will never give up on her. I will do anything to keep her safe. Who is you this? Have. Do you want to go back? Of course I do! Hathmel, Lucinda Zane, Garth, Kim... I may not have told them everything about me, but they care about me. They're the closest thing to family that I have. I will not let him have them! <laughs> That's a good decision, the Aaron. Alright then, I'll help you. But uh -huh. who are you? Who is if this? If you are truly determined, I can help you escape death. But from there, the rest is up to you. Am I dead? Are you truly determined to save her? To save all of your friends? Yes! I will never give up. Then this is my debt repaid. Go. Fight for them. Wait, who are you? Who is this guy? What's going on? You never told me who you were. Just... an angel. Now go, before I change my mind. An angel? Why do I have a feeling that this is someone I know? Anyways, come on Aaron, survive! Survive for all everybody! Holy sh- Holy crap, he fell a long way, where did he land? Well, where is he? Oh, he's Holy oh, oh oh my god. That really hurts. Ooh. Is that a dream? Aaron, you gotta pull that knife out. It will hurt, but pull it out. <sighs> Minecraft graphic. I need to get up. It hurts. I can't die here. What is wrong with you, Aaron? I just want to see her. You're sneaking out to see that that girl? You barely oh know her. Her God. name is Athmal. I don't care what her name is. She's not important. I love her. You don't know what love is! But I- Enough, Aaron! Talk back to me one more time, and I'll make sure you finish this high school year back at the military academy! <clears throat> we had an agreement. I'd let you go to public school under the condition that you stay out of any relationships other than acquaintances. And oh now here you goodness. are, trying to leave to go to this girl's house. What have I told you? You are an Ultima! You cannot have these kinds of relationships! Yes, I can! You never trust me! And for good reason! Look at your eyes, Aaron! Your emotions are still unstable! You will become a monster if you can't control them! Wait a minute, What's wait a minute! So this is the reason why Aaron is f never to have a relationship? Because his father knew he was the Ultima and Aaron knows it but didn't tell anybody? Holy crap. Holy sh- I really don't want to curse though, but holy sh- oh. This is- oops. This is really big news for me. Oh my. 
Huh. This is really interesting. I never knew this. Alrighty. I'm, I don't want to see this face, so let's see what happens. Pull yourself and end up turning her! That's the last thing this family needs! Oh, I can see the headline now! Son of major corporation owner turns student into a werewolf! Ultimas exist! Humans fear werewolves again! Do you understand how much is at stake, Aaron? You'd never treat Melissa like this. Ooh, it's like I have to have this conversation with you every year. Your sister cannot turn people into werewolves, Aaron. You can. It's not fair. Life isn't fair, Aaron. You don't think I went through the same thing? I kept my distance from everyone when I was your age. Even with your mother, I continued to do that till this day. I knew what could have happened to me and all werewolf people if I lost control. I don't want this for you. But you have to understand the situation you are in. But... Go upstairs, Aaron. And don't come down until your eyes change. And I'd better not hear any more of this Aphmau girl. You're better off being alone! Man, what an asshole his father is. I don't want to be alone. Come on, Garth. Find Aaron, he needs your help. Oh my goodness, this is so much to take in. This can't be happening. Is Aaron really? He's dead? I need to get back to the lodge. Kim could be in trouble. Come on, do so. Oh no, don't go back for. Well, you could go back for her, but what about Aaron? More minute. Okay, we got we got a decent amount of minutes. What's going on? Another flashback. This is when he was wearing the bandana and the hoodie. Huh? Me? What's going on? Excuse me, sir. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Huh? Strict orders from your father. I'm here to keep you from getting close to anyone. What? Your father's ordered increased security around campus. To make sure everything's safe. You mean to keep me from having a life? He doesn't want me to have any friends. Your words, not mine. Ugh, are you kidding me? Afraid not. And after that little stunt you pulled last time, he's not taking any chances. I just visited! Do I have to tell him everything? You should ask him. We're not sure how you gave us the slip before. Now we have to make sure we know where you are at all times, even who you talk with. Please, leave me alone. That's not up to me. You should go back to your dorm. Father and refute, refute, refuse. <laughs> I was 
never great at acting. Why had Caitlin decided to cast me as Juliet? <laughs> Didn't you both take theater in high school? She just trusts you. <sighs> More like she's just using me to get guys to audition for this play. <laughs> I'm sure it's not like that. Oh, I'm sure it's like that. You're in the Okay, audition. I'm like 70% sure. <sighs> Sorry you know, for the noise. you don't need to audition for the part of Romeo. I appreciate you wanting to help, but don't you think it'll be weird? Weird? Why? Well, because we have to kiss. I mean, I wasn't thinking about that. It's been a long time since we've... <laughs> but plus, that means you have to take off the bandana around your... Aww. Aaron? Yeah? I just realized it. But that's the bandana I gave you in high school, isn't it? I mean, it was nice material, and it lasted really long, so... <laughs> Why do you still wear that bandana over your face? You've been doing it since college. Uh... I mean, it must be hard to see out of it. Uh, plus, don't you think it's a bit odd? I mean, I'm used to seeing you in it, but... I'm sorry. It's not a problem. It was an honest question. So I... No, I was just teasing you about it. But I thought about you. Huh? I'm sorry for what happened between us in high school. I know that at that point, we were thinking about being more than just friends. But we were so far apart. It was hard. And all the stupid stuff that happened. After everything we've been through, you're still here for me. Of course I am. That's F, really sweet. You were my first friend. I was never going to abandon you. You make me happy in more ways than you know. Aww, that's so sweet. I miss seeing your eyes, Aaron. Why? They were beautiful. It hurts that you hide them. I don't think you'd want to see them. I can't control. Hmm? I mean, I've gotten used to this. I won't make you. But looking into your eyes made me happy. Oh, That's so sweet and adorable and cute. What the? What's happening to Aaron? What the? He took it off? Oh my goodness. How do they look? <laughs> they look just like the Aaron, I know. <laughs> Good. Aww. <laughs> this is so cute. I never feel alone when I look into your eyes. You should never feel alone. Will you always be here for me? Always. I won't give up! Oh my god. I am going to get you back, half -bow. Hold on. I'll be right back, guys. Alrighty. I'm back. And so far, Aaron has red eyes. And, oh boy. I'm a Oh, it's near the end of the episode. Crap. I just hope whatever happens next in episode 15 will make it better. Let's see what happens. He's his eyes are red. Can you see through that? Lodge. Oh, oh, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Oh, it's dead. I've my lucid and state of mind controlled. I need to go back. I need to. Aaron? I'm alive. 
why are you wearing that over your face? Are your eyes okay? I'm fine. What is... What's he gonna do? Listen to Saint Erfo! Ian has them! We need to go back! We will. And Ian is mine. What's going on? Oh, come on. That's it? Oh, man. Seriously? This is how it ends? Well, Aaron is alive. That's pretty good. I like the sound of that. And also, I just hope Ian is dead by the next episode. And also, Afmal, Zane, Lucinda, everybody else that's under Ian's control is back to normal. Uh, I just don't know how to feel about this right now. I just want to see. Afmel and Aaron back together and normal again. I just don't like seeing something that made me cry the next episode now get me more tense up. Like, I'm expecting the next episode by tomorrow. I just... Uh, I just don't know how to feel right now. It's just... I, lo I, I love it that he's alive. I'm happy to see he's alive, but I want to see him kill Ian and stop him. That's how I feel right now. I just hope he does, and I hope he's a, he will be dead. I just, urgh. oh my goodness. Well, I guess that's it. I'll just have to wait until episode 15 and I'll do a reaction of that. So, thank you guys for watching. Go subscribe to Halfmail and watch her videos. They're pretty awesome. So, I leave the episode to Afmal and her com and her production company to make a good epic ending to Minecraft My Street Emerald Secret. I just hope I'm waiting. I'm hoping that this next episode is intense, full of high pack action, and Ian dead. I just hope so. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys for that ne for that next reaction. Goodbye.